What's up, everybody? This is Bruce, aka Geektacular, and um, today I'm actually going to be shooting a few different videos about the uh, Soul Calibur limited edition fighters guides. Um, so they've actually started making these limited edition guides since Soul Calibur 2. Um, and there were some like normal official strategy guides for Soul Blade and Soul Calibur as well. Um, but since Soul Calibur 2, they've been putting out sort of these um, limited edition um, sort of premium fighters guides. And uh, I've recently picked up the ones for 2, 3, 4, and 5. So I just thought that I would record a few videos. So if you're interested in the other ones, um, feel free to actually check out my channel. And I'll actually have videos for all the other limited edition Soul Calibur guides too if you want to see uh, what's up with those. But today we're going to be talking about the Soul Calibur 5 guide. So, um, it's actually very large, and I'll kind of show you sort of a close-up of the cover here. Um, and this is actually, this is a hardback book. It's hard like a, um, like a textbook or something. Um, some of the other guides are technically hard covers, but they're more sort of like rigid, um, soft cover books. But this is actually a legitimate hard cover. So you can see that there. It's made by Future Press. And if you just want to see how big it is, I mean, look at this book. Good gosh. It's enormous. I was shocked when I saw how big it was. I mean, this is a large, large book. Um, so we'll take a look at the side here. So the side is all black. It's a Soul Calibur 5, the official guide right there. And on the bottom, it has Nightmare. With Siegfried sort of um, sketched in the background there. So that's the back. And I'll just kind of show you um, sort of an overview of what's inside. And the thing about this guide is actually that... Um, is actually that this one doesn't have a soundtrack CD. Uh, most of the other previous ones did, but this one actually doesn't. So let's see if we can take a look inside here. I obviously won't show you all the pages, but you've got sort of a little prologue thing there. And then a very cool two-page um, art spread there with all the characters. Patroclus and such. And then there is the overview of chapters. So how to play, system guide, game modes versus play and extras. Um, and then here it kind of separates the guide by character. So there's basically um, a few initial, uh, it looks like about the first hundred pages there are, um, are actually just general, um, general information. And then from about 100 through the rest of the book is all um, separated by each character. So this is just the kind of stuff um, that you'll see. There's a lot of screenshots, full color, um, lots of info about all kinds of different strategies and things like that. Um, there's tons and tons of information, um, how to do pretty much anything you'd ever want to do. All kinds of basic strategies, while rising, jumping, crouching, eight-way run back turn, BT. It also uses, it teaches you sort of a lot of the lingo and stuff like that too. How to do stances, um, lots of screenshots. And like I said, eventually, this is about the first hundred pages. So let me flip through. So versus play, <clears throat> this section is actually where they start talking about um, character specific stuff. Um, and then they give you a quick glossary of terms. So like, for example, this is Patroclos, the, uh, his section. So they sort of, um, rate him on all of his different aspects. Um, they tell you how to focus for his particular play style. Um, it, it analyzes every single one of his attacks, how to do them, um, sort of exactly how they look, what they do. Throws, wall combos. And it has a lot of charts like this, too, um, that have different bits of information on them, uh, combos and things like that. Um, 
And then it, it explains to you essentially like the strategy that you would want to use while playing as him. And also a strategy for other people playing against Patroclus. And then a giant command list with um, how to input um, what level the attack is on. So like high, mid, low, that kind of thing. Um, the damage that each one does, all kind of, basically every single um, aspect of it. So essentially they cover all that stuff um, for every single character, which takes up um, pretty much the entire rest of the guide. So, um, and actually, I mean, this guide is... And they also cover the bonus characters like Double Jin and stuff. Um, and then one more thing, at the very end, there's kind of an extra appendix, and it shows you every single piece of equipment um, and how to get it. So, like, for example, the fieldwork hat looks like that, and you have to reach player level 18 to unlock that. So it tells you how to unlock every single piece of equipment, shows you what they look like, um, how to get it. Also, I think it, it also, yeah, here it covers all the weapons the same way. So it tells you how to unlock all these weapons. Um, this is actually, this guide is almost 500 pages. This is page seven or 479. So this is almost a 500 page book. And this is actually the um, paper insert that um, is on the back of the book when it's wrapped. So um, when you take off the plastic, this is actually kind of sitting on the back of the book. Um, so I'll just kind of show you what that looks like there. Again, it's just sort of like the back insert uh, there. I, I kept it, I just stuck it in the back of the book, just because I think it's kind of neat. Um, but So yeah, this, um, I don't, I think this is out of print now. Um, this was a limited edition book, um, but you can find it pretty much in most places for, you know, maybe like 15 to $20 usually. New, um, I got mine new. So yeah. That's what the SoCal 5 uh, Limited Edition Fighter's Guide is like. And like I said, uh, if you like this, if you like SoCal, check out my channel because I'll be covering the other um, Limited Edition Guides too and kind of showing you what's in those. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.